Good morning, my everyone. Today I am going to explain you about Bernoulli and binomial distribution. Okay, let me start with Bernoulli distribution. So, what is Bernoulli experiment? A random experiment which results in only two possible outcomes: either success. Or failure is called your Bernoulli experiment. So, what is Bernoulli? Any random experiment which results in two possible outcomes, either success or failure. For example, the result of your examination, first sem examination. So, when your student writes the exams, what are the two possible outcomes? Either pass or fail. So, Bernoulli experiment is an experiment which results in any two possible outcomes, either success or failure. And success is indicated with the letter P. And failure is indicated with the letter Q, which is nothing but 1 minus P. Okay, success is P and failure is Q, which is nothing but 1 minus P. And the examples of your Bernoulli experiment is tossing of a coin. So, tossing of a coin results in two outcomes, either success or failure. For example, I want head. So, getting a head is success and getting a tail is failure. And one more example, student's result, either pass or fail. And one more thing you can go for that is uh, rolling of a die. I want the number 5 to be the output. So, if I roll a die, if I get the number 4, I will call it as success. If I don't get the number 4, it is called as failure. So, any experiment which results in any of the two possible outcomes, either success or failure. Success is indicated with the letter P and failure is nothing but 1 minus P which is nothing but Q. And this Bernoulli distribution is given as it will take only two possible outcomes, 0 and 1. And the corresponding probability will be Probable zero means it's nothing but your failure. Failure is nothing but your Q, which is nothing but 1 minus P. And success is nothing but P. Now, and we know that total probability is 1. Total probability is 1. So, success plus failure equal to 1. So, what you will get Q then failure? 1 minus P. Failure equal to 1 minus success or you can write it as success equal to 1 minus failure. Okay. For this particular distribution of Bernoulli, very important topic. You can expect this question for 4 marks. So, we will go for mean and variance. How to derive mean and variance of Bernoulli distribution. So, mean. So, what is mean? Expectation of x. Mathematical expectation you have studied. Expectation of x is called your mean. So, what is the formula for mean? And this is Bernoulli distribution is a discrete distribution. So, we start with the symbol summation. And summation or how many values does it take? 0 to 1. x equal to 0 to 1. Expectation of x. So, what should I write here? x into p of x. Now, for substitute x value over here. First, x equal to 0. 0 into p of 0 plus summation symbol. So, plus next 1. 1 into p of 1. So, 0 into what is probability of 0? Probability of 0. Q plus 1 into probability of 1. What is probability of 1? P. So, 0 into Q is 0 plus P. So, mean of Bernoulli distribution is nothing but your mean P, which is P. Bernoulli distribution mean is P. Now, we will calculate your variance. So, what is the formula for variance? Variance equal to second moment minus first moment whole square. So, what is second moment? Expectation of X square minus expectation of X whole square. So, what is expectation of x square? We need to calculate minus expectation of x. What is expectation of x? Which is nothing but mean. What is the value of mean? P. So, P square. So, I will calculate what is expectation of x square. So, what will happen to the expectation of x square? Same as win, we can, we can calculate it. Summation. What are the values of summation? Bernoulli takes only two values, 0 and 1. 
expectation of x square. So what should I write here? x square into probability p of x. Now, first substitute x equal to 0. What will happen? 0 square into p of 0. Summation symbol. So plus x equal to 1. So 1 square into p of 1. So 0 square is 0. And what is probability of 0? Q. Plus 1 into probability of 1. What is probability of 1? P. So which is nothing but 0 plus P. Which is equal to P. Next. We are going to calculate expectation of X square is nothing but your P value. But what you are required to calculate? Variance. So we will substitute the expectation of X square in your variance. That is your equation 1. So what will happen to your equation 1? Variance equal to expectation of x square. What is expectation of x square? P minus P square. Now what will I do here? We will take common P. If we take P common, what do you will get? 1 minus P. So what is 1 minus P? 1 minus P is nothing but your Q. 1 minus success is nothing but your failure. So the variance of Bernoulli distribution is P into Q. So variance is P into Q and mean is nothing but your P. So Bernoulli experiment means what my experiment which results in only two possible outcomes. Success and failure. Success is P and failure is Q. And mean of Bernoulli is P. And what is variance? PQ. Okay. Now we are moving on to the next topic that is binomial distribution.